Baptism is birth into new life in Christ. According to the Lord's will, it is necessary for salvation. Jesus, in his dialogue with Nicodemus, taught that no one can enter the kingdom of God without being born of water and the Spirit. The word baptism has its origins in Greek. It means immersion and bath. Immersion in water is a sign of death from which the baptized person emerges with a new life. Moreover, to bathe in water implies a cleansing which occurs. On our pilgrimage through the Holy Land, we visited the Jordan River, the very origin and foundation of Christian baptism. It was here that Jesus, before starting his public ministry, submitted himself to the baptism given by John the Baptist. The waters did not purify him. Instead, it was Christ who cleansed the waters. Jesus did not need to be baptized since he was free from sin. He did, however, desire to be in solidarity with humanity to reconcile us to the Father. By commanding his disciples to baptize all nations, he established the means by which people would die to sin and begin to live a new life with God.